You are welcome back to the review show, and that's a double reference. Um, oh God, that's the earliest record for a reference in the video. Done. Right, so today's video will be the first video, first of the six videos, I believe, for the exoskeletons. Um, uh, now, this will be the Iron Fighter exoskeletons, and you'll also come with a color changing Super Zing. So, uh, Super Zing, I keep calling them Super Zings by mistake. Um, that may or may not wind some fans up, but uh, it's just like muscle memory because I've been collecting these things since it was called Super Zing. So the name Super Zing is like engraved into my um, brain muscle cavity, yeah, whatever it is, skull. <laughs> that's it. Uh, that, that's, that's that's more like a like a like a cage for your brain. Okay, enough of that weird stuff. Halloween was there last month. Anyway, um. Let's get on with more of these. Um, there will be a new hero super thing this time. Will I have to move the camera up if, if the space gets filled up with super things? Probably. Also, don't mind if I do clumsy super things, because uh, that's just muscle memory. Sometimes I do it without knowing. Anyway, let's get the exoskeletons boxes. And they're all the way over here. I don't know why. I don't know why I didn't prepare them first. Move that down there and get them out here. Right, here they go, here we go, with some me, that we go. Alright, hopefully this goes alright. Here it is, here's the exoskeleton's box. This has been sitting on my unit for ages, like, since two months ago. I think we've been on to like three months ago at this point. I think it was three months ago. So this, it's been sitting in this house for a long time without me touching it. But hey, that is the life of unboxing channels. Anyway, uh into battle exoskeletons as you can see here's the iron fighter with the paladins compatible with kids wow what about adults and also 12, 12 exoskeletons to collect all these boxes contain one uh, exclusive super thing plus one exoskeleton do i have to move these characters up here i think i do let's do that now apologies but um <sighs> do I move? Oh. You know what? I'll do a jump cut and I'll come back with all this stuff being not re reorganised. Right, I'm back. My current collection now resides over to the side, if you can see that, just about. Uh, which means as soon as I have to get as soon as I get a rival, this desk will look more clear because this side's got more stuff on it, like exoskeleton, like um, arrow wagons and checklists. The, uh, this checklist is here to remind me about any names if I forget them, which is a bit stupid because I'm meant to be an expert. Um, but yeah, a lot of this stuff is a bit full. Um, there's some more stuff over to the side. It's like, not, it should be normal desk stuff like the uh, Sports Direct Mug, the Sonic. Um, but there's a, it's kind of just filled up with some stuff that should really be moved. So when this video is done and dusted, I'll try and clear the desk off because it's scarcely getting in the way. Because if you remember, in the old um, in the older videos for Rescue Wolves and Neon Power, I would have the rivals lined up to the um, side of the desk, just about here. I can't do that because there's so much stuff in the way, as evidenced by the big orange thing I managed to make out of brick separators. It's got Bowser Jr's face on for some reason. So this, I don't know if I've shown this in the video before. Some other stuff, there's some more Lego stuff to the side. That is the result of my last attempt at tablet apps video. Where I got so bored watching the adverts, I just built random stuff. Like, just out of boredom. So, and that's just stayed on the desk for eternity. So we'll deal with all that lot later. For now, I am fighting exoskeletons. There is a chance of finding a gold exoskeleton. In other boxes, the example here used is the gold iron fighter one, so we do have a chance of finding the gold iron fighter excluding in, in this place, very unlikely. If I do find it, which I won't, um, it's it'll be the same as um, yeah, you know, that'll be the second gold item I would have gotten because the first one was the gold Kazim cider from uh, Kazim Kids way back before I started doing videos. One series before I started doing the series nine videos. Anyway, enough of that random torture. Look, there's um, Rocket Ride with, what's his name, Galaxy Guy, no, Star Bandit and a, of course, um, Galactic Glider, a Saturnalia, and then the other two, uh, Jungle Trumper with Drippy, and uh, 
toxic soil. It's got a quite, quite poison, but no, it's toxic soil with fungus. Uh, if you remember, we actually, we actually already have a toxic po a toxic soil in yellow, so the color displayed here is the alternative one. I hope it looks just as good as the um the one we got in the starter pack, which was toxic soil yellow. Right, so let's open this box up. Oh, let's have a look. If you buy them from Amazon, they're not going to have any of these weird prices in these boxes. Um, I think the Spanish address is also on here, along with the British address. Right, let's open the box up. Then slide this part in. So now you have a complete store display. I was going to say the uh, Iron Fighter ones, but now it looks like the Galactic Gliders, but I'll keep to my word, let's do the Iron Fighters ones first, because uh, they're, they're out now. I think they're on the list as being first, so if they uh, so um, they won't. So apologies if uh, you were expecting the ones at the front, or well, I was. You lot probably won't, but the point, uh, point is, I was. I think there's a gold excess gold, and might be the... Uh, the flying one, the uh, the what's one fly rocket rider. Um, so let's have a look at these boxes. Now, one change from the previous live of the skeletons is that then they've now got unique artwork on them, which we've already seen from the box I just showed you. But this means that they're not blind. Um, the only thing that's technically blind is the color of the exoskeleton and the color of the super sing. Uh, in this case, what colours do these guys come in? Right, so the Sir Paladin comes in purple and in green. So if we get him in green, that will mean we'll start, that's our first, well, it's not our first look at the, oh no, I was going to say it's not our first look at the green colours changing because he comes in green, but since it changes to, it's green changing to yellow, it's a different, got to be a different shade of green. Yeah. Right, so they all come with unique art. There's a name on the top, which is, Similar to how the uh, supercars, superjets, superbots, you know, the other previous box vehicles aside from um, the Exocultons and Yompa, of course. So they're bringing that back, which I do enjoy. Pilots can be piloted by a Super Sing or a Kazoom Kid. Fine Ultra Gold Exoskeleton, which uh, is only inside of. Should be inside of these or the or or like another mystery one. I don't know. If, I don't know what exoskeleton it is. It could be Rocket Rider. It could be Stone Smash. It could be Toxic Saw. But I know that the Gold Hero exoskeleton is definitely uh, Iron Fighter. The same art is on the side, but um, it is reversed. It says Special Attacks, but I don't really. Oh no, it's the. Also with colour on. It says special attacks, but I don't think I think that his fists might not do anything. I think it's stationary. On the back, like always, we have a checklist uh, of all the exoskeletons to collect. Uh, so, and there's like an opening box at the bottom. Let's get it open. Right. So it's not the uh, the gold one. Oh, we have a oh, we have a new checklist. Does this have the art of Birthday Boy riding the, uh... No, it doesn't. There's art of Birthday Boy riding on the, um... Uh, Rock... No, it's not Rocket Rider, it's flipping, um, what is it? It's, um, not Rocket Rider, it's, um... Uh... Galactic Glider, that's it. It's just occurred to me that I'd still need to do scans of the checklists that came with the Kazim kids. If this is different, I'm going to have to do a scan of this. I don't think it will be though, but who knows. I will have to do a scan of this checklist because it looks like it'll be different. Yeah, it will be different because stuff on the back. Right. Super Sing Meet and Battle exclusive Super Sings. There's Birthday Boy and Berry Cream, Fryzer and Muscle and Chup. And we've seen this before. The uh, Toy Range Iron's. On the back it's something new. It's the Pizza Cop and Trevor Eyes from the previous series. The Superbot Power Arms and Superbot Trasher we've seen in early videos. Secret Base, Kazim Power and Fury Storm from the... 
previous series, and Super Dino, Hatrix, and VRX, and Rescue Truff, and Rescue Force, which was the series before Neon Power. So, they're still marketing stuff that came out two series ago. Ooh, interesting. I also have some wipes. So, you don't need to worry about me just running off. And uh, let's have a look at this. It looks like we have the green version of Sarah Paradox. Which we do. Here he is. He comes in the colour green. And he should change to being yellow. So we get to look at the first evidence of colour changing yellow characters. What do I think of him? He looks very small. He looks quite cute actually. He's got a wooden sword which won't help him, which won't help him very much. I think it's a... This is like a Roman design, isn't it? It's not meant to look like that. It's meant to have like a plume or something. It's not... It's not meant to have like a mohawk design, it's meant to have like a plume. Anyway, what do I know about history? Not much, apparently. Right, let's get to assembling this. So this looks like it is normal. There's a thing for the, uh, oh. Never mind, it's a bit tight. Does this have any special attacks? Um, yeah, it does. These fists spin. I thought these would, well, I thought these would be like stationary, but no, they, they spin. Ooh, interesting. Um, right, so the legs, hang on, give me a minute, the legs, a clip onto, the side, presumably you need to jam them in there so they don't come off, I think that's done it, so this is the, this is the, uh, the red version, I believe. So then, where do these go in? Oh no, there's the right, left, and lockers on the front. But that's confusing because that it swapped around. Shouldn't that be left? Shouldn't that be right? That's right, not left apparently. So, uh, this says left. So this must go into this hole here, and it's. Got the wrong way round. There we go. And then the other one should go into the other hole. There we go. So this is a look at Iron Fighter. What do I think of it? I think it looks all right. Um, the big metal fists. I think. I didn't, I think they'd be a lot smaller, but no, they're quite big, and because of that, I think it looks like quite a good exoskeleton on his, I believe it does appear to be very made of metal, and you, the best thing is, if you can put it up like this, it looks like it's about to fly. Why? I think the best thing is, if, is you can put this down here, and you could maybe, like, make it head and stick it onto the top. Looks like some kind of weird body, actually. What do I make of that? Weird. This is like a body without a head. Isn't that a bit weird? I don't know. Right, so the Paladin, he goes on the side to colour change. And if I'm correct, the other one should contain the blue version of the Paladin, but I don't know if I don't, don't know if that's how it works. I think it does. Because if you're getting both colours of Exodus Guardians, you're probably going to get both colours of the character too. But hey, what, but what do I know, eh? I mean, we've been doing this for two series. Yeah, you get the purple one. So here's the purple for Paladins. Yeah, I think the tra this shade of purple looks alright. So he changes to blue, we'll be seeing him later. So th yeah, th this is the, um, the red version of Iron Fighter. So I know how to assemble it now, let's do it. Oh, actually, no, I need to take it off to uh, sort out the hands, because they're a bit fiddly. I think that's insecurely, I don't know. So, this version of Iron Fighter... Is the one you'd see, I think, on all the uh, the prep, on the promotional material. No, it's the blue one. Sorry, it's the blue one. Sorry. Is that in? It won't go in anymore. Hang on, let's have a look at this. Left, right. 
It's not going in, but I think it won't go in anymore. Hang on. Oh, it's tight. It's very, it's very tight. There we are. This is the other version of Iron Fighter. Oh, this joint's a bit loose. Have a look at that. This one's quite firm. This one's just like, it's like loose. Quality controllers. But uh, yeah, so what do I make of this colour? Very good. The red hand's a bit of a bad colour choice, except the entire hand is red, so uh, I'll let you off. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I su what, what I suppose you could do is you could s swap the legs around because they're the same moulds and have it so they're just like one colour exoskeleton. I don't know, I'll do a jump cut. Never mind actually, while I was doing it, the plastic warped a bit, plus the, uh, the foot came off, but we can uh, hopefully get that fixed with... Yeah, I'm not doing that again. Because, uh, it's a little lucky to, uh, break the plastic. In fact, I think it is already, I think it is already broken. Have a look at that. Oh, great. Will it go back in? Will it? It won't. So just the life of manufacturing. Uh, so... Oh. Is this exoskeleton going to have to stay broken? Important PSA, do not try this. We have the exoskeletons, it won't end well. Does it go the other way? No, it goes in this way, hang on. No, no, I've, I've done it. <sighs> Yeah, I had like a collector heart attack there. But yeah, I'm not trying that again. Risky biz. So yeah, that is uh, the Iron Fighter guys. The 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 Knight Brothers. And there will be. Hang on. That's a Ghost Sager reference. Hey! Notice how I didn't say Mega Force. Um, so the next one's on the list. I've done the first lots will be Jungle Chomper, and I'll be very excited to see how the chomping mouths work. I hope they actually chomp, but uh, see you then, mates.